types of diseases. Let's learn about the different types of diseases. Airborne diseases. Diseases that spread through air are called airborne diseases. When a person suffering from cold, flu or viral fever coughs or sneezes, germs spread in the air. Anyone who breathes this infected air catches the disease. Common cold, flu, measles, diphtheria and tuberculosis are airborne diseases. Contagious diseases the diseases that spread through direct contact are called contagious diseases. Ringworm, scabies, mumps, chickenpox and conjunctivitis spread by touching the infected person or sharing towels or handkerchiefs, etc., with an infected person. Vector borne diseases. The diseases that spread through insects are called vector borne diseases. Malaria and dengue spread through mosquito bites. When a female Anopheles mosquito bites a person suffering from malaria, the germs enter the mosquito's body. The mosquito doesn't get infected, but when she bites a healthy person, that person gets malaria. Lice cause typhus fever. Plague spreads through rats. Vaccination Vaccination is a preventive measure. The vaccine injected in a person's body enables him to fight that particular disease. Even if the germ of that particular disease enters his body, he is safe. Polio, measles, whooping cough, diphtheria, hepatitis, mumps, etc. can be controlled through vaccines. Most vaccines are injected into the body. Polio vaccine is given through oral drops. Look at the vaccination chart of the different vaccines given to children. When there is an outbreak of cholera or typhoid, health workers from the public health department of that state set up health camps to give vaccine to prevent the disease in the people. Now, scientists are trying to find a vaccine against malaria. Prevention is better than cure. Don't you agree?